Welcome back. We're following who? What's his name? Do you even know how to say his name? No. I don't know how to say his name either. All right, here we go. He's showing us the operation. This guy Brilljorf? right here. Brilljorf? Brin? Brilljorf? <laughs> Brilljorf? Bjorn. Problematic. Jorf. We'll call him Bjorn. How's that? Wow, cold. That's all you get. This is an all right little operation, I guess. Would you fucking go? There's shit over there. These people sleep in the sewers. What the fuck? Where are we going, bro? Yes, this is the one I was talking about. Our new recruit. What the hell does that, that guy have on his head? Oh. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. Oh, I'm sorry, what? If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. You break the rules and you lose your share. What? No debates, no discussions. I'll kill you. What we say, when we say. Do I make myself clear? Yes, but holy oh. That's legit. Do it. I'll let that comment go because you're new here. Ask things out of turn again and we have a problem. Now, are we clear on all of this? Yeah, okay. <laughs> you seem to be a man that uh... I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Wait a moment. You're not talking about Golden Glow, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of work, so let him prove it. Golden Glow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Brynjolf will provide you with the details. Brynjolf? No, sir. Aren't you forgetting something? Mm -hmm. Okay. Since Brynjolf assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us, then you're in. Welcome to the Thieves Guild. Welcome to the family, lad. I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin, so don't disappoint me. You I like. That other guy? Simple. Fuck him. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Oh, and talk to Tanelia and the Flagon. She'll set you up with your new armor. New armor? Nice. Okay. Golden Glow Estate is a bee farm. They raise the wretched little things for honey. It's owned by some smart mouth wood elf named Arangoth. Oh and yeah, I hate wood elves. a lesson by burning down three of the estate's hives and clearing Can out I the the hive down? No. <laughs> I'm good at that. What's the catch? The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. Aww. My client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Makes sense. Aye. The last thing we want to be doing that is, is crossing our That is one fat chica thief. Or is that a dude? Maven prefers that Arangoth remains alive. But she's going to stop kind of me from getting the job done. Kill him. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. So we're supposed to kill him? Uh, just clear out the stage. Just, just scare him, I guess. Which is what I wanted to do the last time. You watch yourself on that island. Those mercenaries don't take prisoners. All right, but there's a book here. Written by Devin Mallory. So I'm assuming he's some sort of a trainer. Probably. Hey, Can buddy. he teach you something? You're making waves around Train here. me to be a big pocket. Up to no good, are we? I'll teach you. But it will cost you. <laughs> That's where his money well spent. I think so too. Uh, I'm not, what? You're not saying anything. Quit fucking with Come me. Come back and see me. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think you took a wrong turn there, sir. 
Why don't you save this for later? What? What? Why? Save it for later. Stop being a dick. Come here, a second. Archery? I'll show you what I know. Oh, you're already in master class already. Come find me if you need more marksman training. Yeah, where is everybody? I think it's right there. Hey, hey! I want to talk to you. Now. Okay. You're pretty tough. I respect that. Bringing in a lot of coin for the guild. Making us look good, too. Yeah, well, that's no, what I do. I need anything. Yeah, okay. I think you're, in the part, you're going in the right direction. Just not. I joined up with them maybe ten years ago. Small clan, maybe twenty men. Go get your armor. Great village. He's asshole, Ron. He's not doing anything for you. But it was always about the killing for them. But not for Don't you. Don't get me wrong. The first few years with that clan were some of the best years of my life. All the food I could eat, all the wine I could drink, and all the women I could bed. What changed? We raided a caravan That's a nice life. spring. I think it was a few wagons with some farmers moving to a new village. They didn't put up much of a fight. All that was left were the women and the children. Then the leader of our clan, Garthek, he ordered us to kill the rest. The fuck was that, really? <laughs> Nasty bastard! We usually let them go. I refused to do it. It's like a fucking Garthic creaky door. The clan to kill me as well. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Luckily, I had made some friends with the clan. It's like a damn creaky door. We <laughs> tore each other to pieces. You need to all that ass. That's what over. You need to Those do. of us that remain simply went That's our separate what you ways. <laughs> Get some WD-40 and all that shit. I get wreck into the caravan. <laughs> <laughs> never knew what became of the rest of the clan that survived. <laughs> I suppose they moved on just like I did. Damn. I joined up with them maybe ten years ago. What are you doing? Ago. You talking his ass again? Uh, there, there's a door out. Don't you have better things to do than to Oh, the opposite me? way. No, no, go back the opposite way. That's your way out right there. Go uh, other way. I want to see if... I wanted to say something. Lock biggie maybe? Pull up a chair, my friend. This is quite a tale. When I started out in this business, I wasn't really interested in the guild or being a... I didn't mean to imply I was earning an honest living, either. What? With my lock-picking aptitude, I was a natural at jailbreaking. It's where a client pays you to get arrested. Usually it's to free some. Either way, the trick was in the escape. Well, as a jailbreaker, you work alone. No guild to back you up. I do jobs for the Thieves Guild and the Dark Brotherhood, but if things didn't go as planned, I was on my own. I think I see what you're getting. The last jailbreak I attempted failed. I was imprisoned in High Rock for three years before they let me go. After that, I promised myself I'd never do it again. So why did you join the Guild? I don't know. I think I realized I'm that out of right the now. world, my <laughs> skills would bring me more wealth as a thief. Killing some... I already knew Delvin. I asked if I could oh, train up. And that Wanted was to that. say something. Some other time, perhaps. What? Go straight. Other way. There's a way out. Other way. Uh, keep going. These people train me and shit, yes. though. Oh, he already trained me. He's just dangling his fucking boots. What in the? You gotta pick up your armor, ho. From where? I was. You telling you? Go I out. said not that. I said go directly the other way. You went around the side in the first door you saw. I said no, the other way. Go around, but no. Look, look at these boobs. How could you say no to these boobs? What boobs? They're there. Why don't we step outside? When you get back in here, uh, go straight to your left and go to the first door you see on your left hand side. Uh, there. Here. Go in. There you go. Now it's not a door. That's to the flagon. That's where you're going. Why the fuck am I going back to the flagon? They told you to talk to Vex. To Devlin, whatever the fuck his name is, and it's off to Tania, and she'll give you your armor. Am I the only guy that pays fucking attention here, really? No. Uh, the direction. 
You're stealing shit from their fucking... God. <laughs> you think thieves will notice if I stole their shit? Yeah, it's just a little legal. You gotta talk to him first. Breed your fight. Let me guess. He just plucked you off the street and dropped you into the thick of things without telling you which way is up. Yeah, pretty much. Right? Yeah, know what I'm doing. Lying to my face isn't gonna win you any favors with me. I can promise you that. Dude, on the other end, taking some of these extra jobs off my hands. Now, that'll get you to the top of my list. I suppose I could use some advice. Here. See, that kind of attitude comes from someone who wants to get rich and stay alive long enough to enjoy it. <laughs> We're gonna get along nicely. So. If you've got the nerve, I've got plenty of extra jobs to help get the guild back on its feet. Okay. Look around you. The flagon, the guild, it's all falling apart. A few yeah, days ago, pretty up this place was as That's what happens when you build in the sewer. Yeah. Now, you'd be lucky if you don't trip over a skeever instead. Look, I know the others think I'm a bit dark for saying stuff like this, but I'm going to give it you straight. Something out there is piss drunk manners. I don't know who or what it is, but it's beyond just you and me. We've been cursed. A curse? What can we do I'll about it? I'll tell you what we do. We spit in that curse's face and turn things That's around. That's a good idea. Here. Put I don't know that that works the way he thinks it works. Huh? That's where you come in. I've got plenty of work available that could guide us down the road to recovery. All you need to do is ask. We you have swept that this, fucking section of floor since I met you. I wouldn't take any jobs yet. Okay, you talk to Vex. There's work to be done. Right there. Before we begin, I want to make two things perfectly clear. One, I'm the best infiltrator this rat hole of a guild's got. So if you think you're here to replace me, you're dead wrong. I'd just like to hump and you. two, you follow my lead and do exactly as I say. No questions, no excuses. Okay. Before we begin, I want to make really? one, I'm, and two, then we understand each other. Now, it's time to get your feet wet. And I don't want to waste a lot of time talking about anything but business. What's I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. We're in a bad way down here. Who knows? Old Delvin thinks it's some kind of curse. I think he's crazy. If you want my opinion, I'd say it's just plain old bad luck. That's called a curse. <laughs> you can get out there and start making a name for us again. Yeah, Make I would them start say so. fearing us like they did long ago. And while you're at There's it, make a little bit of coin on the side. Not a bad deal, eh? Go to Lockpick and see how much, uh... The unusual gem, remember? Yes. All right. But if you get arrested, don't blame it on me. Well, you're already down there. since I've seen one of those. What you've got there is a stone of Baron Zaya. Is it worth anything? Not like that it isn't. The stone was pried off of Baron Zaya's ceremonial crown by a thief in order to cover his tracks. I think there were 24 in all. Most people keep them as a curiosity. What the fuck? Some of the guild members have tried to locate them over the years, but they haven't been successful. Well, until now. Look, I only buy things I can turn around quickly for a profit. And no one wants these stones unless they have the whole set. Tell you what, if you find the rest of them, talk to me again. Otherwise, keep it. Maybe it'll bring you luck. I have no choice but to keep them. Go talk to Tania so you can get your armor. These jobs aren't going to finish themselves, you know. Shut the fuck up. Tanalia? So you're the Tenalia, new recruit, huh? Well, looks like you and I are going to have to get very well acquainted. Yeah. Do you mean in a sack? <laughs> I'm the fence down here. You come oh, by nice. anything you don't exactly own, and I'll pay you some coin for it. Minus a little slice for the guild, of course. I can also provide a few supplies useful to our trade now and again. For a small fee. Sure. How about I get Dirge to knock you over your head and dump you into the cistern? Look. I've been in this business a You long seem so time, nice when I've we first met. Types. Now I just want to stab you, you in your face. Tough, or you can play it smart. Whatever. At the end of the day, you'll find that all we care about down here is how much gold you can make us. 
Understood. Good. Then there isn't much more to say. Here's your armor. Just make sure you put it to good use. All right, then. Is it better than what we have? I don't think you have a choice. Seventy-two versus what? What's up there? Scroll up. Go to shrouded armor. Seventy-two, seventy-two, same. But what's the difference? That's muffled. They're going to be both the same. Let me see. Go up though. Oh, plus effects. four on the thieves' guild boots. Yeah, it's better. Pickpocket success, fifteen percent better. Carrying capacity by twenty. We need that. Yeah. Yeah, he need to put some stuff up. <laughs> what a dick. Welcome to the cozy little family. I'm one of the. So what do you look like now? If you're looking for extra work, talk. What do you give me for these? Special rates to members of the thieves guild. Show me what you've got. Baked potato. Beggar. Do I have any weapons that I want to get rid of? Glass Warhammer. Five twenty nine. Just about cleaned her out though. She's got four thirty six. Get rid of the Emperor's robes. She's got three twenty two left. God, my speech is increasing. Put all that stuff up. I don't think you'll ever get what it's worth. But these are the shrouded robes that I took. Yeah, I would put that up. I wouldn't sell those, sir. I would put those up. Why? Well, they they have abilities. Mm -hmm. Look at yourself. Now you're a member of the Thieves Guild, sir. All right, great. Now where am I going? Uh, other we're, going way to go. set, we're going to set shit on fire, right? I think you went the wrong way. Why? Because you're supposed to go the other way. Remember he opened the, the pantry or whatever? You're going the wrong way. What was that? Yeah. yeah. Something tells me you shouldn't be down here. Shut up! What are you doing? The bitch was over there. Okay, fine. I'm going. From here, you hit left. I just want to stab people. But you can't. That's not your job anymore. That's always my job. You know, you're supposed to hit a left where you were in there. So you're bring your growth in there, okay? There you go. Good job. And now you hit another right when you get out of here. So we've done what do we what do we increase? Pickpocketing? Yep. There's got we didn't do did we do lock picking? We tried to do lock picking. Yeah, you were already better than the guy was already. To the great. Need something? Nope. <laughs> I'm good. The Black Briar Meadery. One of the largest and most successful businesses of its kind. Budweiser. Bud. Wise. Like that toot. <laughs> toot or a creak? <laughs> <laughs> That's what that should be. You want to see my Valenwood? <laughs> my native of Valenwood? Pull the switch, dickhead. Hi, Helen! Turn around, turn around, turn around. Achievement Explorer. Hey! The coffin! Mm. 
Can you can't. I think it's a good place to end it, sir. You're really gonna steal the shit from the priest. Dude, it's like an 88% chance. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't touch that one. Do it. <laughs> nice. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> Sir, that's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. It requires a key. What oh, shit. Well, on that note. We can actually end the episode here. And we're going to be... I'm actually probably going to end up continuing this. Just because. Is it going to tell me to go outside again? And then we find out later that we don't need to go outside? Why don't you use your map? This is just a douche like that. That's what's going to happen. Isn't it? Yep. Yeah. Look at that blood dragon. Anyway. How do you know it's a blood dragon? Because that's what they look like. That looks like a, just a dragon dragon to me. I don't think so. I think that looks like a blood dragon. Well, I guess the blood dragons actually have the freaky looking tails. Er, er, er. Stupid. I can't see your tail. Oh no, maybe it's a blood dragon. I can't really tell now. Huh. Oh well. Thanks for watching. Remember to leave a like and a comment down below if you want to keep up to date with what we're doing. And until next time we see you, I'm going to get out of here. And I don't know what Jesus is going to do, but chances are he's going to get out of here too. Yep. So, hasta. Bye. So that, wait, what? what? It's a short walk, sir. Yes, it is. Thanks for watching. Bye.